I welcome you to today's spiritual breakfast. I bring greetings to you. Hello everyone, praise the Lord. Very good morning and I'm happy that God has brought us together to meditate this for today. Hello everyone, praise the Lord. Very good morning. I'm happy that God has brought us together to meditate His word. May God speak to us even today as we meditate His word. Today's meditation is from the same verse that we meditated yesterday for almost three days. Uh, Acts, the book of Acts chapter 17 verse 11. Now the Berean Jews were of more noble character than those in Thessalonica. For they received the message with great eagerness and examined the scriptures every day to see if what Paul said was true. <clears throat> we see here that... Uh, the very first spot is what we are going to meditate and end up. Uh, now the Berean Jews were of more noble character. Bible very clearly teaches how can a man become noble in, in justice one verse. It, it requires three qualifications from, the, from that man or a woman to be noble. Number one, you should be very eager to listen to the word of God. Number two, you should listen to the listen to the right doctrine number three you should do some researches or you should examine the word of god that is what very to to be uh, precise we can say that as much as you love the word of god you will become a better being that's it to become a noble character this world is teaching so many things they say that go and do yoga go there some sits in some places and uh, do not let anything disturb you close your eyes and do some meditations it will bring nobleness in your heart and you will become a noble man no those things cannot bring nobleness in you you cannot become noble because of those things the bible says as much as you love the word of god as much as you give importance to this word, the word of God, it will make you noble. It will take away all the bad characters from you and it will make you a noble man, noble woman. The world will respect you. In the, to to, to uh, come out of the anger, to come out of this uh, stress, you don't need to go and see some things in this world or you don't need to follow the things the world is following. We have a better solution here. Love the word of God. As much as you love the word of God, you will come out of all those, all those sufferings, troubles. You will be a noble man. You will be a noble woman. Love this and this will make you a noble man and noble woman. Amen.